Hiya, um, I'm James here from Decor Quip. Um, I'm very lucky to have the guys from CW Applied Technology to join us for a factory tour. Um, it's been a fantastic day and I'm very grateful for you guys to come. I really appreciate that. Thank you. Yeah. Um, and I'm appreciated all the feedback you've given us, so it's good. Um, I'd like to go through a couple of questions that I've got here for you, if you don't mind me check. asking. I think you have a very strong lean culture. There seems to be great ownership um, by people in the whole lean uh, approach. Um, it's a working process, as, as we're all on the same working process. It's, you're never totally satisfied. It's always, uh, you can improve and do better, but you know, you're obviously on the right road. I don't think there's any argument there, so uh, I, I'm very impressed, very impressed with your culture. I think we have some great takeaways, um, one of them being the check sheets that you've put into place there. Uh, that's something that we're definitely going to look at and bring back to our own facility. Yeah, I yeah, think the, um, the Kanban, uh, I love the, uh, the QR code where you scan that and it sends an email to the buyer to place the order. Yeah. I'm not a great fan of sending the email to the supplier because I'd like to know what we're buying, yeah. but um, I think that's, that's brilliant because at the moment we don't have, we, we have a much more manual system, so that's something we'll definitely take back. I also like to add that um, I love the idea of you building, um, ma making use of the leftover roller parts and uh, making your own little jigs yeah. and stuff. Uh, the conveyors for the for the plastic bags. Thought that was a great idea. Mm. And the uh, the new packaging area you have there with the rollers. That's that's yeah. class. Yeah. Yeah. And all the work Adrian has done in his area. I think that, you know, if you can roll that out to other areas, that's going to be hugely beneficial to you. Yeah, he's yeah. colour-coded everything. Uh, yeah, and the work of Pat, when we're talking to Pat as well, mm. it's, uh, it's really, it's impressive. You know, it's constant, you're obviously constantly improving, so it's, uh, it's good to see that. There's one thing I would recommend, um, I saw a lot of two, bo two boards going around, but no, if you took the tool away, the, there's nothing to tell you where to put it back to. So if there was a photograph there of that tool behind it, you might know where to put it back to. And also maybe colour coding those tools as well to the areas that they belong to. That way, if somebody takes it, you know that belongs in my area, actually, you can see the colour of it. Brilliant. Yeah, and I, I think like, I, w I wouldn't be any way critical at all, Not because at all, no. I, we're coming along, mm. uh, we're kind of parallel on, on, on the journey. Um, but I'd say try and use as many visual controls and just keep plowing on and moving forward and that's what you are doing um, but yeah as many visual controls as possible yeah. so there's two things I'd suggest um, and I've said this to you already James um, you're obviously generating quite a bit of dust in your process so you know if you can s find some way of eliminating that as you've talked about um, but also maybe a deep clean in all your benches because there's a lot of dust on the legs and the bars mm -hmm. and stuff and dust is a habit of finding its way anywhere, um, especially mm -hmm. places you don't want it to go, so it yeah. could find its way into your product. I get, I'm assuming it doesn't, but yeah. you know, it's, it would be no harm, I think, to address that. Could, yeah. um, and the second thing I'd suggest is that when you're setting up a workstation that you eliminate as much as possible everything you don't need. And I know that you make many varieties of blind, uh, blinds and, and rollers, and, and you have lots of different options, but there's almost too many options. If you remove a lot of those, um, for, from a, for a particular build, then you'll remove possibility of error um, and take some pressure off maybe your yeah. operators, make it easier for them. Yeah. I suppose, one, if I can say one other thing, if you can do more videos and show us what you're doing, and you know, we're very happy yeah. to share videos of what we're doing, so we'd love to see more videos from other companies in this two second lean. Brilliant. Brilliant. Yeah. 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 So we can see your you. ideas. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Yeah. And Brilliant. thank you for having us here today as well and taking loads of time out of your yeah. day yeah. to show you're us very around. Welcome. Yeah. Yeah. We appreciate no. that.